Hey everyone, this is my soda bottle Bell Siphon test number two. First test didn't work very well, I think I didn't have headspace, so I uh, cut a bottle a little taller, and it siphon looks like it's about to form, we'll see if it works. draining out of the bottom. Not a siphon yet though. Oh, there it goes. You hear the cheese siphon. Now will it be enough? I'm using an Eheim 600 pump lifting of about 70 centimeters. Maybe it was 70. Um, it's coming out over here from a schedule 13 pipe, 13 millimeter PVC pipe. My stand pipe that I drain are 16. 16 millimeters that is. And you can see I've got a lot of flow coming out here. Uh, at the moment, I have my, my ball diverter turned off, so a full flow is coming up to the top. So by adjusting this, I can adjusting this ball valve, I can adjust the flow of water to the top tank. might be necessary if the siphon doesn't shut off it by itself. So far it's looking okay. Nice thing about using the clear soda bottle is, uh, well it's free, and also it's clear. You can watch the siphon form if you don't have media in your bed. I imagine this could be a very good teaching tool. Let's wait and see what happens. Got about another two centimeters to the crenellation at the bottom. Is it going to break? Beautiful. There she goes. I guess I'm ready to put in some media and add some fish. Start cycling. Thanks for watching, everyone.